My experience on the day of transplant was, again, 6 a.m. wake up. I had to be present at the hospital while they took my mom's kidney. And I'll never forget waiting and waiting. And it was about four hours until I got admitted. And my first and only question was, is my mom okay? And I never found out till that evening when I woke up in the recovery room and this little munchkin was there and my mom was nowhere to be seen. So of course my big concern was, is she okay? And I got the, yes, she's doing just fine. And that we were both on finally, uh, myself on a road to recovery and my mom doing healthy and uh, doing all right. So when I um, look back on it, it is a life-changing experience. And I'm sure your perspective on it was a little bit different. What did you do on the day of transplant, and how did it go for you? Um, well, we all got up at 6 a.m. <laughs> um, so there was this one time where I looked up and the hospital was right there. And I remember thinking to myself, this is where it begins and this is where it all happens. Um, and I was there when she woke up. And I remember trying to hug her, but there are lots of wires, lots of lots tubes. of wires, and I remember getting my foot stuck. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of the biggest things that I'll remember. Lots of tubes in both of us. <laughs> I remember looking at the clock and just thinking to myself, "Why isn't she in bed? It's 9 p.m." <laughs> <laughs> so on the day of transplant, we both got prepped at 6 a.m. for the transplant. I was first, of course. After they took it out of me, after the surgeon who did the operation uh, took my left kidney out, they put it in a bowl of ice so that it would be ready to go into Nikki's left side. My left kidney is now her left kidney. And from my perspective, of course, I was asleep, but I do remember in recovery, a doctor coming in and saying that her kidney, my kidney, as soon as it got into her, it started producing urine, pee, right away. And that's the best thing a mother and a donor could ever hear. I guess in closing, um, talking about kidney disease is something that's very close and near to dear to my heart, as it is with these two also. I am over the moon happy that we are able to bring this presentation to you and inform you more about staying healthy and drinking lots of water and treating your body um, in a positive way, such as eating healthy and avoiding fast foods and high salt foods. It's important to go ahead and understand how your body works, your kidneys, your heart, your pancreas. It's important to keep those healthy and I hope this presentation has brought you some education on how to do that. And I hope that if you have any questions, you're able to ask those from your presenter and that they bring you some answers.